was good. Well, there's still a little left. It's all gone. Oh, hello, folks. Better put that away quickly. For I'm the one, the only Hobo Tom. And as you can see by the very different colors on my face, I'm finally recovering. I, my Wolverine healing powers have kicked in. I'm almost all peeled out. I'm getting probably way too much sun last weekend. Thank you very much, the Miss Crumb. I enjoyed it thoroughly. And I would gladly get burnt all over again just for that. But let's get back to business at hand. Not here to talk about what I did on my weekend when I had my lady friend with me. Again, check out past videos. You can actually see her um, in various states of consciousness. I think she had a long day. She eventually like passed out on the couch. That was kind of cool to see. She trusted me enough to pass out on my office couch. That's a good thing. I'm not here to talk about that. I need to find something. Extreme. Um, mainly extreme rules. Yeah. This is going to be a weird card. The first thing I shall say. There shall be a bonus. And the fact that. They're going to have one of three matches. The one bonus I'll predict. For the pre-show at least. They'll have Sheamus versus... Uh, they'll have... Um, what am I saying? Not Sheamus. Shinsuke Nakamura. King! Shinsuke Nakamura. Taking on Apollo Crews. They have to have something for the pre-show. Uh, if not, it's a whole conspiracy. Mainly the fact that I'll be able to watch the pre-show. I think. Because I go to church. Yeah, I should be able to see it. Um, Shinsuke Nakamura retains his title. Nothing ever important happens on the pre-show. Shinsuke, King Nakamura wins. Um, I don't care about Sergeant Aziz anymore. Although he, although he did get promoted. He's just not first sergeant. He's such not sergeant. He's now first sergeant. Oh, uh, that's okay. So let's get to this, uh, main part of Extreme Rules. There are very short matches. So this is either going to be another short show or they're all going to be long matches. I prefer the shorter show because having some of these matches go long will not be good. Let's start off probably Liv Morgan versus Carmella. If it wasn't for one other match, I wouldn't care about this match. You never know what could possibly happen. A top coming off. Bottoms being pulled down. In this match, Liv Morgan wins. Kind of who cares. Um, then I'm going to be sobering up because probably... Or for whatever this match has happened, this is what I'm going to kind of lay on the couch and sober up. Charlotte Flair versus Alexa Bliss. Raise your hand and honk your horn if you could care less about this match. This is going to be the match that I take a nap through. So really, who cares about it? You know what? I'll just say Alexa Bliss wins, though. She'll be the new women's champion. Whatever. Then we have the Usos taking on the Street Profits. You know what? This is going to be Hobo Tom's match of the night. I don't think many belts are going to change hands. I could see the Street Profits winning, but I see the Usos really keeping those belts. Usos retain their belts. And this leads to a feud later with Alpha Academy. That would be good. Then we have 
Damian Priest taking on Jeff Hardy, taking on Sheamus. Again, Jeff Hardy's there to take the pin. It would continue the thing between Damian Priest and Sheamus. Damian Priest, however, wins and retains his title. Then we have the Raw Women's Champion, Becky Lynch. No, SmackDown Women's Champion, Becky Lynch, taking on Bianca Belair. At least this will not go six seconds. This will go a little bit longer. This should be a decent match. It honestly depends on how much ring rust Becky Lynch has. And a little bit with her cardio shape. Mind you, Becky Lynch is in phenomenal shape. Oh my goodness. She doesn't look like she gave birth at all. She looks honestly in better shape now than she did before she even met Seth Rollins. So I'm kind of shocked with that. Becky Lynch is going to win. We'll see what happens. She retains her belt. It's going to be a status quo. This would set up something good between Becky Lynch and possibly Alexa Bliss. Come Survivor Series, maybe? I don't know. We'll see. But in my stone cold lock. We have Roman Reigns taking on the demon Finn Balor. The real rock and roller. Um, you know what? Stone, uh, Roman Reigns. I almost said Stone Cold. But Roman Reigns is going to retain his belt. In my Stone Cold lock. That's really it. Uh, I to talk about. Other than the fact that I should hydrate myself. From drinking so much. Thousand Lives Red Wine. It is that red wine pizza. So again, those are my predictions for Extreme Rules. Um, which is turning out to be a, whoa, very meh card. Again, please like, share, comment, subscribe. And I will be putting out, I think, one more video this week. I don't know if it's going to be tomorrow, during the day, after the day, or Sunday during the day. I don't know. Whenever I can get to reading my notes that my cat seems to be playing with a lot. Other than that, I'd like to thank everyone for watching. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. And that's